And besides, who don't love a good beauty haul, right? <laughs>
there is no R, so it's not croquette. So I hope I'm saying it right. It's coquette. I will put the spelling down here just in case. And this one is a hot singles eyeshadow, but it is matte or maybe a satin. But to me, they're both kind of the same anyways, like when it's actually on your eyelid. To me, it gives off the, the same type of zhuzh. <laughs> But this one is a little lighter of a neutral tone, so this would be a very, oops, this would be a very nice transition shade. Then these last two shades, ooh, they screamed my name when I seen them. This one is Wild Orchid, and again, it's in the Hot Singles eyeshadow, and it is this gorgeous red berry tone. Oh. Oh, it's a beautiful, beautiful fall color. Oh, it's so nice. It's got the right shades of like berry with like a little bit of red apple-y kind of feel to it. Oh, I can't wait to try this one. And the last one from NYX is Pink Lady. And this one falls in the same family as the previous one, but it's got a lot more pink tones in it. So it's the same kind of berry type tone, but with a lot more pink tones than the red. So these five shadows were the first shadows to my custom eyeshadow palette. Get yours today. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> Oh, those single eyeshadows were actually only $5 each. So the next store that I went to was MAC, and I wanted to get my Giga Black Mascara, because it's the best, I'm telling ya. And because NYX was unfortunately sold out of their Magnetic Z palettes, I went to go get one from MAC. So I got their magnetic palette, just plain Jane empty, and this was only 10 bucks. So the prices of the empty palettes between NYX and MAC actually wasn't that much difference in price, so I did not mind grabbing it from MAC at all. And of course, my extended play Giga Black Mascara in very black. <laughs> and because I was in there, you know, you can't, like, I can never just buy exactly what I go in there for because my eye always gets caught on something else. And that is exactly what happened to me this time. So I also picked up some other <laughs> single eyeshadows from MAC because these guys were only $8 each, which I know is a bit pricey. I don't know, for one eyeshadow, especially considering to five. But then again, it's not that much of a difference. Anyways, so I grabbed three. I grabbed Rule, which is a beautiful natural nude color. It's a perfect shade of brown. It's gonna be great for fall. It's gonna be a great transition color. I had to grab it when I seen it. I was looking for a color like this at NYX, but they didn't really have a good, basic, nice, neutral, beigey brown color. But, of course, I found it at MAC. <laughs> And this shadow is Wedge. And this one is another fantastic transition color. It's a nice nude, but with kind of like a taupey or, you know, uh, a cooler undertone. So this is going to be a fantastic transition color for those beautiful fall looks. And the last shadow that I grabbed is Nylon. And this one is another highlighting shade, but it's actually got some yellow undertones to it. So I'm, I'm excited to give this a try. And I'm even more excited to put my whole custom palette together. <laughs> well, apparently I am a forgetful Franny and completely forgot to film an outro. 
Wake up, Amanda! <laughs> well, guys, I hope you really, really enjoyed this new makeup haul because I am so excited that I have a whole NYX store that I can shop at and take advantage of. <laughs> well, guys, I will see all of your beautiful faces in my next video. Mwah! Love you guys!